the shield emitters on India must be disabled if we are to reactivate Cyrus. The time to begin is now, Hierarch. Cyrus, the vault of the purifiers. It is fortunate that Avon's brood has been unable to penetrate its stasis grid. I now have access to Endion's records. Hmm. The stasis grid is sealed by complicated locking mechanisms. They can only be destabilized by a certain device. The Megalith. I'll begin recovering it now, so it may work on the locks. It will need protection. These forests already crawl with Zerg abominations. Then we shall clear them out. If I may, Hierarch, this facility once developed powerful weapons for the Empire. Ah, I have heard tale of the mighty Colossi, scaling cliffs besieging enemies from afar. Let us see how they fare against the Zerg. The Zerg are coming from that cave. If we fire on the rock formation, it will seal the opening. Authorization in progress. The Megalith should be ready shortly, Hierarch. We will monitor its status and alert you when it is online. The Megalith systems will take a few moments to activate. It will be ready to move out soon. In the meantime, I've upgraded our robotics facilities to construct Colossi. You can warp them in whenever you wish, Hierarch. Command me. I stand. The Megalith should be finishing up shortly. We should ensure that we have enough forces to defend it. the spaces locks safely.
The megalith has reached the first stasis lock. It will be safe below the surface as it does its work. point the megalith is almost done with this lock I would advise you to make preparations for its next move show the first stasis lock has been disabled. The megalith is relocating to the next one. We have full power. Prismatic core online. Base crystal arrive safely at the second stasis lock. It shall be brought down shortly. Interesting. I believe this facility used power cores of incredible size to provide energy for experiments. They should be hidden somewhere within these hills. If our warriors can destroy them, we can claim the solarite components within. The first power core has been secured. Warping it aboard now. It shall be done. The Megalith's work is nearly complete. It will move again soon. Prismatic core online. Channel the light of light. This vessel shall. We are at full power. The canyon grows narrow ahead. Crawlers, they're rooting on the ridge. Brace for incoming fire. Stasis lock disabled, and the grid is now at 60%. The megalith is en route to the third lock now.
immediately. This rock is almost destabilized. The megalith will relocate shortly. I am detecting a large number of Zerg bioforms in the cave network ahead. We can use the terrain to our advantage. Toggle the rock formations near the entrance and seal the Zerg within the caves. is on the move. My readout shows Cybros beginning to awaken from stasis. Only two remain, Hierarch. in the caves ahead. Exercise caution. There is an entire Zerg hive cluster between the Megalith and the last stasis lock. Our only option is to fight through it. disabling the fourth lock. Identify. I'm listening. 
Prismatic Core Online. Lock destabilization is nearly finished. The Megalith will disembark soon. is down and the megalith is traveling. Stasis grid at 20%. Wait, I'm detecting activity in the Zerg hive nearby. They're reinforcing the last lock. We are at full power. This vessel, Zak Naku Afal. Face crystals charged. Lock is destabilizing and the grid is down. We've done it! Cybros is free from stasis. Recall our forces from Endion's service. We take this battle to Cybros. <laughs> <laughs> 